this is Jen, your exclusive starter business coach, and I want to come in and talk to you guys about my unboxing for Canva. Yes, so um, for those of you guys who do not know, one of my marketing tips I have for my braiders and marketing tips I have for any business is that if you're going to be in businesses, it's in your best interest to make your own merch. Even if you're not going to sell the merch, you can make your own merch, right? Pick chicks and vests. You make your own merch because when you're in your videos or if you're doing content, or even if you're walking around, you know, your neighborhood, you're going to an event and you have on your own merch, that's a way of marketing and advertising your own business. So what I did was I ordered a shirt from Canva. So we're going to open a shirt together and I'm going to actually jump over to my computer and I'm going to show you guys how I created this shirt inside of Canva. Um, so let me show you guys the shirt. So it actually comes with the Canva sticker and it actually comes with like a little thank you card. Then it shows you. It, it's right there, all right? The shirt that came from Canva. So this is um, the shirt that I have. It's the Real Brave Boss, okay? The Real Brave Boss, hello. Um, I think the shirt is um, nice. I think not because of Canva, but because of the kind of font that I chose. It actually looks kind of ashy. I think this would have probably went better. Well, probably not because this is white. Um, but if I would have just did the shirt without the shadow, um, it would have probably looked, you know, a little bit more cleaner. But this is what I got. Even inside, it even shows, it prints camera on the inside. But it's pretty much uh, my Real Braid Boss shirt. And this is a, boss, a shirt that I'm going to be wearing in some of my videos. But I think it's a very good, um, it's good because you can wear your own merch, especially if you're going to be doing content online. And you're gonna be creating videos. Um, but you guys, it costs twenty dollars or twenty-five dollars. That's shipping and you know the shirt. And it took about one week to get here. So I think that that's pretty good. So let's jump over to the let's jump over to the computer, and I'm gonna actually show you guys how I created the shirt. And I'm gonna take you as far through the Canva steps as I possibly can because um, I already got the shirt. But I'm gonna to try to do an example of the same shirt so you guys let's jump over to the computer all right hey pretty gang so we're over inside of canva and we are exactly at the template right I'm gonna put it right here um we're at the template where i already had the real braid boss real braid boss created so there's a new tab inside of canva where you go top right corner where you see the three dots and you toggle low you click it you kind of scroll a little down and it actually says that it prints pictures, business cards, and canvases. So I'm going to click t-shirts. And um, pretty much if you if you create your saying, your logo inside of a template that is um, the wrong size to go on a t-shirt, what Canva does for you automatically is that it resizes, the, the, it resizes it for you, right? Then also, if you want to move... Like if you want to move the the logo or you want to move the saying on the shirt just so we can match up on the corner of the like to match up where it's going to be actually on the shirt like you guys see it right here to the right side wherever you move this it actually moves it on the shirt so if say if you have it lower and you want to raise it up so it can go across your chest you can and you do this all inside of canva and then you go down and pretty much you could just you could select the color you could change the color if you want to you could like i could change it to a white shirt if i wanted to like if this is a white shirt or if i wanted to change it to the, the red we could say you know you could change the color of the shirt inside of there as well and you could change the type of shirt you can make it a woman's a men's you know you could change the size it's up on here it shows up to 2x and you just pretty much click continue then the continue part is actually where it's going to show like you know your name your address you know a uh, payment and then you pretty much hit print and um i think they have like kind of a five dollar flat fee um for your shipping um i know mine's cost like like i said 25 dollars um for the shirt and like i said while it's just one shirt it is your shirt with your logo your business on it which is a great marketing and advertising um, a way, a great way to advertise and market your business. So you guys, I hope this was helpful and I'll be talking to you guys later. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Bye you guys.